Hi, I'm Navid Ansari and in this video I'm going to show you how you can create two wheels of a car and have a car in your game with the right physics. So without any further ado, let's begin. You remember in last video we done this. So we have one wheel that we can climb the stuff, we can go left, go right and we can do anything we want, okay? So now that we have this I want to add another wheel so our car has two wheels for now okay it can have three four or you can have tank okay you can have everything you want so let's just duplicate this I want to call it wheel front okay the the one that we have before I want to call it the back back wheel okay so let's just add this to here so this is our back wheel this is our right wheel okay what i want to do i want to joint these two wheel together okay so you know in your car these two wheel is connected together so we want to connect both of these wheels so let's just play it to see what will happen no everything is working but you can see that it's those are not connected together so how we can connect it let's just show you in the let's just in the back wheel add a create event in here and we should connect it with the joint okay so we can say physics joint distance create okay so you remember from the videos before in the playlist of car a scroll game physics and we did talk about revolute join to create that seesaw but no i want to create a distance joint so let's just open its data sheet and you can see that you can connect two objects together okay so for the first input is the object that we want to connect to another object so for the first input is id because we are using that obg wheel back okay so we want to connect this obg wheel back to obg wheel front so we say the object that we want to connect it is wheel front okay so at the next it says where do you want to connect it okay for the anchor 1x i want to connect it to x and y of our wheel okay our back wheel but for anchor 2 and anchor 2x and anchor 2y I want to use X and Y of our OBG wheel front. So we should say OBG wheel front dot X. Let's just copy it, paste it, and we want to use Y. And for collide, for no, just hit zero in here. And no, we did connect both of them together. But before we move on, we should go to the sprite and change the anchor point to the middle center okay because this wheel is rotating around its center okay so we want to connect the center of these two wheel so know that we anchor this right let's just run it and these two is now connected together and you can see it it's it's working like a car but we have things to do you can see that both of these wheel has motor on them because we add torque to both of them and you remember from last video how we done that but i don't want it to be like this let's just open the front wheel i don't want this front wheel to have any torque okay so let's just delete this key down in here and let's just run it again and you should see that the back wheel will rotate not front wheel you can see that this um, object that we create in here is moving with our car let's just change that i think i did forget to make it a static if you don't know what a static mean in physics in game maker please watch my videos about physics and when you put zero in here it, it would be a static okay so it doesn't have any weight 
and no let's just test test it again and this object won't move again and no we have those two wheel of our car what we need to do now we need to add a body to it so it should have a body but i don't want to make this video too long so until next video thank you very much for watching if you want to help me please hit that like button and subscribe to my channel it helps me a lot thank you very much bye